Hey coders and welcome to episode 1 of our document service playlist on the Google Apps Script course. In this video we're going to be talking about creating and opening documents. So the top three methods that I have for you today are very simple. It's create, open by ID, and open by URL. So let's jump into the code and implement these three methods. Let's first look at creating a document. So if we go into our Google Docs user interface right here, you can see that we already have two documents already pre-made, but let's say we want to make a new document programmatically. Again, to do it manually, you would just hit uh, this blank button right here, or you could do it templated like this. But let's say we want to create a new one programmatically. So the method to do that is called create and you need to access that from your document app. So if you, if you say document app, hit the period button and then start typing in create, you can see that this is the method that we're gonna use. It takes in as a parameter the name of the document that you'd like to create, and then it will return to you that document. So if we just say um, my exciting doc, then if we hit save and we hit run, it'll run for us. After that, let's go check out our Google Documents. We'll refresh the page, and here it is. This is what we just created from this code right here. And you can see it was open at 12.13, and it is 12.13 right now. So let's look into that. So this is our document. Again, we didn't add anything to it. It's just a blank document. But let's say now we wanted to open this document in the code. So to do that, it would be very simple. Again, you would just type in document app, and then there are two options that you could choose from. You could either say open by ID, or you could say open by URL. So let's first open it by URL. So URL is extremely simple. You would just go up into this address bar right here, and you would highlight everything. You'd copy it, and then you would paste it right in here in between two quotes, because this is a string. You hit a semicolon, and actually, let's just log or log that just to make sure that it is indeed returning a document for us. So if we hit save now, and we hit run, and we check out our logs, and we'll view the logs after we wait for them, but it should return just a plain document. And then after that, we can get all the methods from that. So here it is, here's our document, and that is this document right here. Alrighty, so again, you can open by URL, that's totally fine, or you can open by something called ID, and we've seen this many times, especially in the uh, spreadsheet service, and also the slide service playlist. Uh, the, way, the way to open by ID is to first type in open by ID, and then after that, you would just go up into the address bar again, and then you would get this string of letters and numbers that was between the slash, the D slash, and before the slash edit. So this is your ID right here. So let's just copy that and we'll paste it in between two quotes because again, this needs to be a string. So let's comment this out and if we hit save and we hit run, because we didn't get any errors, we should be good to go and we can trust that we are getting this document indeed. And just to make sure that we're getting that document or just to see some of the methods that we can start using now like add footer, add header, uh, get body, all these things are document specific. All right guys, well I hope you enjoyed this video and know now how to create and open documents. We're gonna get more in depth in what you can do after you open this document. But for now, I hope you enjoyed this video. Don't forget to hit the like and subscribe buttons and I'll see you in the next one.